How to change a wheel bearing with a 6 ton press. Here is the 6 ton press that will be used. Jack up the front of the vehicle and remove the wheel. Remove the two washers. Unscrew the two screws of the caliper support. Remove the caliper support. Suspend the caliper to avoid straining the hose. Remove the brake disc. Remove the hub nut. If you don't have an impact wrench, unscrew the nut with a long socket wrench when the wheel is on the ground. Remove the track rod end. Remove the nut of the lower ball joint bolt. Remove the ABS sensor. Extract the lower ball joint. Remove the drift shaft. Remove the lower bolt mounting the shock absorber on the hub carrier. Remove the hub carrier. Place the hub carrier on the press. Place a socket of diameter slightly lower than the internal bush of the bearing. Actuate the lever. Retrieve the socket. Remove the outer and inner circlips. Adjust the height of the press. Place the hub carrier on the press. Lean on the outer bush of the bearing. 
actuate the lever. Six ton pressure is not enough to press the bearing out of the hub. Strike with the sledgehammer to move the first millimeter. Actuate the lever. Strike with the sledgehammer to move the bearing. Refit the new circlip in the outer groove of the hub carrier. Lubricate the hub carrier. The new bearing was put at the freezer to facilitate its installation. Lubricate the bearing. Place the bearing in the axis of the hub carrier. Place the hub carrier on the press. Lean on the outer bush of the bearing. You can use the old outer bush. Press until the bearing stops on the circlip. Refit the second circlip in the inner groove of the hub carrier. Lubricate the inside of the bearing. Adjust the height of the press. Place the hub on the press. Lubricate the hub. Lean on the internal bush. Press until the hub is fully driven in the internal bush of the bearing.
The hub is in place in the bearing. Refit the hub carrier. Refit the drift shaft. Refit the lower ball joint. Refit the lower ball joint bolt. Refit the ABS sensor. Refit the track rod end. Refit the new hub nut supplied with the bearing without tightening to torque. Torque tightening will be carried out wheel on the ground. Refit the brake disc. Refit the caliper support with the caliper. Refit the wheel. Tighten to torque the hub nut.